What are you doing there? How did you get in? Give me those keys, for God's sake. I just wanted to see the inside of that chapel. Nobody is allowed to enter it. If Madam learned you were inside, it would be my fault. Guarding this place is one of my responsibilities, and Madam is relying on me to do it. If you don't tell her, she won't ever know. Well, you're lucky. I would get in bigger trouble than you for letting you in there. Damn, how could he have found me here? I've got to get inside again, but how? It would probably be best to return at night. Strange. It's made of just one piece of stone. Do you have a moment? Hold on. Go ahead. Do you remember our talk about the tomb? Yes, I do. Did you manage to get inside? Yes and no, but I still want to examine it thoroughly. You're starting to interest me, young man. Why have you come to Wales anyway? And why are you so interested in our tomb? Unfortunately, I cannot explain the whole thing just now. I fail to see what draws you to that place so much. I have to get inside somehow, that's all. But? But Louis won't let me. Louis makes no trouble. He's just doing what he is told. If it was something else, I'd settle it for you. But the tomb is a problem. Eleanor is very respectful of her ancestors and guards the place as if it were a shrine. I can't do much about it, you see. Yes, but no one will find out. I promise. I just need the key for an hour or two. No, that's quite impossible. Eleanor takes the key from Louis in the evening and keeps it in her bedroom for the night. What do you suggest, then? Me? Well, maybe. I can't promise anything, but if you help me out, I'll make it easier for you to get inside. I'll do what is needed. So what's the plan? I'll explain everything later, but I have a couple of rules. First, you will come down here when it's dark. Second, you must not tell anyone. Why are you doing this anyway? You mean why am I helping you? I have my reasons, just like you have yours. So... How is it? I will do anything if you get me inside. All right, we have a bargain then. I'll leave you to your work then. I'll go to my room and rest a while. I've got to get into that tomb again in the evening. I waited until the last sound had quieted in the mansion so I could be sure I could leave my room unnoticed.
this place looks entirely different at night. There's no way to see inside from here. Richard has locked himself in. Did he forget about our agreement? I need to draw his attention somehow. A few small rocks. I'll try to hit the window. Missed. few small rocks. I hope they hear that inside. I'd better go to the door quickly. I've been expecting you. Follow me. So is everything clear? Yes, I believe it is. I'd better describe the whole process once more. No, that won't be necessary. I understood everything. You will have to assist me. Follow my orders exactly during the whole experiment. Agreed? Of course. Variant 2. Variant 2. Variant 7 follows. Nice and simple so it has time to mix. I understand. Back to variant two. Number three will follow. Two and three follows. Now we must wait a little. Right, this is the moment. From now on, it's going to be easy. Just keep turning it down as I told you. Yes. Easy, easy, keep going. Right then, we're mostly done. We just need to add the oxidant. Oxidant? What oxidant? The one you managed to break this afternoon. What luck you had catching the druggist. Well, maybe I should tell you something. Hurry up then. The time's almost up. The oxidant, you see, it actually isn't... No! happen? I checked my calculations to the smallest detail. A mistake was inconceivable. Well, maybe. You needn't apologize. It's not your fault. I must have made a mistake with the ratio somewhere. Damn. Yes, everyone makes mistakes. Well, you have fulfilled your part of our agreement. Now it's my turn. It's right there by the door. That green flask. Flask? You promised to get me inside the tomb. I have promised to make it easier for you to get inside. You must realize I could not look Eleanor in the eye if she found out I had lent you the key. Sure, but what do I do with that flask? 
The container is of little importance. It's the content that matters. It's a strong concentrated acid that will dissolve most metals on the table of elements. That should do the trick for you. Right. Now, it's completely destroyed. Hopefully, Richard won't find out what happened before I leave. I think he may not have even seen the light of day for a few weeks. The explosion has pushed it over. Now a chemical of some sort is pouring out of it. It's going to take Richard quite a bit of time before he begins another experiment, I'd say. Strong concentrated acid that Richard gave me. We'll see how strong this acid is. Very well. The lock has fallen off. Secret passage. I can't go any further. The tomb is locked like a safe. At least I know I'm approaching my goal. I think I'll need the right key. The lock looks odd and quite complex. That symbol on the lock, though, I've seen it before. I think I'll need the right key, the lock that sim- I would like to ask you something, Richard. Oh, give me a moment. I'm listening. There is a symbol of a very unique cross-like shape in the chapel. Would you happen to know anything about it? Oh, I think I know what you mean. It's an old symbol of the nobleman of the manor. It's strange, though. I've never noticed it there myself. Eleanor has got the only remaining one in her jewelry box. I'd like to see it. Where exactly is that box? She tends to keep it nearby. It's probably somewhere in the main hall. The mansion will be closed for the night. Take my key from the table over there. Thanks. I'll leave you to your work then. The entrance is locked. 